Self-IGO products leverage award-winning proprietary signal processing to deliver the industry's best voice and data performance for wireless subscribers. While there are two versions of the Self-IGO products for stationary installations, the planning, installation, and provisioning of them works the same way. For simplicity's sake, we will use the same model throughout this video, but the instructions apply to all GO stationary products. Self-IGO is designed to amplify cellular signals in stationary, non-mobile environments by connecting a donor antenna to receive the macro network signal and sending that signal to the main unit which cleans the signal up and sends it to a server antenna which delivers the boosted signal where it's needed. Parts to assemble include the self -I Go unit, an AC power adapter which is supplied with your Go unit, the donor antenna along with an appropriate mounting bracket, and the server antenna. You can contact your sales representative for more information about the full line of self -I antennas and mounting brackets. Antennas and antenna cables are not supplied with your Go unit. The type of cable required will be determined by the length of the cable run and environment the system is installed in. Now we are ready to plan the installation of these components. Use your cell phone to find the area with the best signal strength. This area may be indoors or outdoors. This is where you will mount the donor antenna. For best performance, try to keep the distance between the donor antenna and the GO unit as short as possible. Now find a specific location in the area that had the best coverage for the installation of the donor antenna and mounting bracket. Don't mount the antenna or bracket yet. Continue the planning process. Next, find a location for the server antenna in an area of the building where improved coverage is needed. Keep in mind that maximizing the distance between the donor antenna and the server antenna will provide maximum gain and a larger coverage area from the server antenna. Now we need to find a spot to install the self -I Go unit. When choosing a location, make sure you find a spot with good airflow, close enough to a power outlet, and close to the donor antenna. This will help ensure maximum input signal from the donor antenna. With the planning complete, we are ready to start the system installation. Start by mounting the donor antenna bracket and donor antenna. If mounting an antenna outdoors, Use the supplied U-bolts and make sure to use appropriate lightning protection. Route the donor cable back to the area where the cell phi go will be installed. Next, mount the server antenna in the planned location. If possible, you can use the mounting hardware supplied with the antenna. If needed, you can also use a cell phi antenna mounting bracket for the server antenna as well. Now you are ready to install the go unit itself. When permanently installing the GO unit, make sure you carefully inspect for existing plumbing or electrical lines prior to drilling any holes. Carefully mount the self -I GO. And connect the antenna cables. Make sure the antenna cables are snug. Then connect the power cable to the side of the GO unit and plug it in to an outlet. With the installation complete, we are ready to register the system, aim the antenna, and test the installation. We can now use the Selfi Wave application to register the device and optimize the installation. Download the Selfi Wave app from the App Store or Google Play. Open the Selfie Wave application and accept the terms of service. Make sure the Go system is powered on. The Selfie Wave app will search to find the system and then guide you through connection. Bluetooth LE must be supported on your handset and enabled. Some mobile network operators require that you register the unit prior to using it. If this is the case, 
The WAVE application will prompt you to register once the application is connected to the Selfie Go. Follow the instructions provided to complete the application process. Once registration is complete, the Selfie WAVE application will display a dashboard. You will see the performance prior to aiming the antenna. The next step is to aim the antenna. If you are using a Selfie supplied mounting bracket, you can use the antenna positioning application within the WAVE application. To use the antenna positioning application, first navigate to the settings menu of WAVE, then select antennas, and then select antennas position test from the bottom of the menu. Rotate the eight position antenna bracket to position one. Then click the capture button next to position one. The system may take a couple of minutes to complete an analysis of the signal in each position. Once the first position is tested, rotate the antenna bracket to position 2 and press the corresponding capture button on the application. Continue this process with all eight positions if possible. Once the test is complete, the application will highlight the location with the best service. Turn the antenna to this setting and use the locking pin to secure the position. Once the antenna positioning is complete, navigate back to the dashboard which will supply feedback about how the system is working. The dashboard will advise if the installation is great, OK, or poor. If the installation is only OK or poor, the Wave app will supply suggestions on how to improve the installation. That's it, you're all done. We hope you enjoy the improved coverage and faster data rates from your new Selfie Go system.